Hi everyone, it's Christopher, Mono County Library Director and co-host of the Oxygen Starved podcast. After being away for a week, I'm back with the 100th Book Talk Friday. This project started a couple years ago as a way of highlighting the variety of new titles the Mono County Libraries get, but also to remind you of the many wonderful books we've had on our shelves for a while, waiting for you to come check them out. Titles you may have missed the first time around or may just want to reread. Now my pick for the newer title this week is Matthew Quick's We Are the Light. It just came out in November. You might recognize Quick. He's the author of The Silver Linings Playbook, a novel that was made into a movie. In We Are the Light, making a movie actually serves as an important device of the plot. Now, taking place in a small community that has recently experienced an unspeakable tragedy, Lucas is a new widower, struggling to move on with his life, but is visited by his deceased wife in the form of an angel every evening. When 18-year-old Eli, shunned by the community, starts camping out in Lucas's backyard at night, it's this angel who points out to Lucas that his future, the kid's future, and in fact the town's healing lies in the two of them working together. This book has been blurbed by the likes of Mitch Album, Harlan Coben, and Justin Cronin, who states, We Are the Light is a treasure of a novel, wise, humane, and deeply moving. Whoever you are, whatever trials you faced in life, read it and be healed. Now, this notion of a widower finding his way through grief to a life beyond brings me to my older title this week, Ann Tyler's The Beginner's Goodbye, which came out about a decade ago. Now, I've talked about Tyler before. She's a prolific writer, usually of family foibles and drama, usually with quirky everyday people set in or around Baltimore. In fact, NPR once called Tyler the patron saint of misfits. Her novels are often quiet, character-driven voyages of discovery, and this one's no different. In it, 36-year-old Aaron, after having what is described as a relatively happy and remarkable marriage, finds himself alone when his wife Dorothy dies in a freak accident. But like the other book, Dorothy doesn't completely go away. She keeps reappearing to Aaron as he moves through his day. So to him, she's an active participant in him processing his grief and grappling with who he will become. This title got great reviews when it came out, and in giving it a starred review, Publishers Weekly stated, This is no gothic ghost story, nor chronicle of a man unraveling in his grief, but rather an uplifting tale of love and forgiveness, and by the end of this wonderful book, you've lived the lives and loves of these characters in the best possible way. This is The Beginner's Goodbye by Ann Tyler. This is We Are the Light by Matthew Quick, two great kind of brief novels available at Mono County Libraries. Come in and grab these or another great novel to read. In the meantime, stay safe and happy reading.